Hey friends, this is Face Away Cable Curls. So I'm going to show you a few reps before we get into it. So. Okay, a couple things here. Uh, first of all, I am using these fat handles. Um, I love these for curls. It's easier on my elbow versus the skinny handles. You can use these if it's all you have, but I love... Um, the fat handles but either way so with these the goal is to train the bicep the long head in the lengthened position so you want to keep your upper arm behind your body and the way you're going to do that is set the cables low enough i'll tell you how to determine that in a sec and then um, walk out so when your arms are just kind of hanging they're about that far about 20 degrees behind your body um, you don't want to go so far that your shoulder is like rolling forward like this but about right here is good. It's, it's more just kind of how you feel. Um, okay, so now because you want to train that lengthening position in the long head, you want to keep your shoulders uh, behind your body when you curl. So keep them back here. And all you're going to do is just curl just like this. Notice how I'm not like going in and kind of going like this. I guess my, my cables can't do it anyway, but a lot of people go and kind of go a little too much range of motion. So just keep your arms behind you. And just like that. Just like this. And now ideally, um, the resistance will be a little more on bottom. It'll kind of go harder to easier. So uh, play around with it until that happens. Um, a couple ways to do that is to adjust your cables. So if you are way too far, like all the way down, and again, this just depends on how tall you are and your body structure. But for me, if I put it all the way down and I go, then most resistance is kind of in the middle, which is okay, but it's not ideal because we want to train the lengthen position with this exercise, that's the purpose. So what I do is go probably about like knee height um, is gonna be well for most people. And then what's gonna happen is that's gonna shift the cable up a little bit. So you can kind of see here, the starting position is a little more angled. So here's the, the line of resistance right here and here's my bicep. That's a good starting place because that will cause the, the tension to be um, most high when you're in that kind of bottom bottom 30 degrees of range of motion there and that's what we want um it shouldn't be so high that you you know you're all the way up here and then it's like really hard at the bottom and nothing on top that's not exactly what we want either so again somewhere around that knee height uh will be good and then other than that just we've talked about always good good curl mechanics don't flop down your weight um go Nice control eccentric, nice controlled change of direction. And uh, done right, this will be pretty, feel pretty good on your biceps.